Well, for many students, college life will look very different this fall. So whether you're living in a dorm or studying online at home, Amy Sewell is here with tips to get your space ready for the new year. Good morning. It is so good to see you again. Amy, first, many of us can remember those lumpy, bumpy dorm mattresses. How can we make those beds a little more comfortable? Yeah, dorm rooms are not necessarily known for having the most comfortable beds. So I worked with Bed Bath & Beyond to put together some tips for you. Now, a great first layer for that bed is going to be a quilted mattress topper. And this one from Therapeutic will put three inches of memory foam between you and that lumpy mattress. Now, a great way to top that is with the Pure Beach Jersey Knit sheets that we have here. These have that breathable cotton fabric that helps keep you cool in the summer and warm in the winter. So that's nice anywhere, but I think especially somewhere like a stuffy dorm room where you may not have as much control over the thermostat as you would like. Whatever you do, though, Check with the school first because some dorms will have twin beds and some have twin extra long, so you just want to make sure that you get the right size so you don't have to return or exchange something later. And you want to remember the bath essentials, of course. And for a dorm, I love quick drying towels like the ones that we have here. You're probably sharing that bathroom with a lot of people, so those can really come in handy. You also want to be able to keep all of your toiletries nice and organized and in their place. And there are a lot of really cute shower caddies out there that you can get to do that. The other thing I love um, for a college dorm is this Revlon One-Step Hair Dryer and Volumizer. Now, I bought one of these last summer, and this cut in half the amount of time it takes me to dry and style my hair. So for a busy college student who would probably prefer to sleep in a little bit more in the morning, this could be a really practical item. Okay, so what if you're living off campus? That's the people I'm thinking about right now. What are some basics that we don't want to forget? Yeah, if you're going to be getting your first apartment, maybe living off campus for the first time, you're going to need to think of things for the kitchen, you know, stocking up on cookware and other items. You might do this this year, even if you're going to be living in the dorm, because you're probably not going to be eating out as much this fall. So you obviously need to have a coffee maker. That's kind of an essential for college life. I love the Keurig Mini that we have here because, as you can see, this doesn't take up much space. It also comes in a lot of really cute colors that you can coordinate with the decor. If you'd like to whip up some coffee drinks, maybe some smoothies to take to class with you, a small blender like this Magic Bullet is handy. And if you like to keep a lot of snacks on hand, which, of course, most college students do, you know, having some stacking organizers like this really helps keep everything in its place. Amy, we have to talk about that chair. Tell me about it. I know. Isn't this chair the cutest? You know, just because your dorm room has a chair doesn't mean you can't bring your own. And I love this faux fur chair. This is, of course, really cute, and it comes in a couple of different colors. But the other thing I love is that it's comfortable. And if you're going to be going to school online this fall, you know, taking classes in that way, you're going to spend a lot of time in that chair and at your desk. So you want to make sure that you're creating a study space that really works for you. In addition to the chair, you know, something like this surge protector power strip is going to keep all those cords in line, keep everything charged. If you look closely at this one, you also see that these outlets rotate. So you can actually use all five of the outlets that are in that. This also has USB ports, as does the organizer lamp here, so it's really easy to keep everything charged up and ready to go. Now this is, of course, a lot of stuff, but Bed Bath & Beyond makes it very easy to get everything to school and just spend little or no time in the store. You can go online, totally do your order there and do a curbside pickup or pick it up in the store. But if you're shopping in July, you can also go on and do your order or scan everything in in the store and then pick it up on move-in day at the store that's closest to college. They make it very easy and efficient for parents and students to do that. If you need some more information about those services and how to organize that space, you can go to bedbathandbeyond.com college.